What's up, guys? It's the Mighty Zingfei 500 here with another episode of Let's Play Shadow Hearts 2. In the last episode, we finished up our business in Petrograd and saw a scene I don't recall ever seeing. I may have in the past and just forgot about it, but it was interesting nonetheless. And in today's episode, we're going to end. <coughs> oh, excuse me. <coughs> well, not really. I was about to say we were going to go end uh, the first disc, but I doubt. To be honest with you, I doubt we'll get that far. Um, but you know what? I probably should start leveling up some. Oh yeah, I can't level him up. I gotta level you up. Soul Charger! I should have done this off screen, but I forgot about it until just now. How about that? Level up you a bit. Let's just at least get our forms up to level 4. Oh, yeah. Keep forgetting, you can't level up the base form, only the form in its maximum form. There we go, and one more. Yeah, this one is so weird. It's just like, is that a female? Is it a dude? I want to say it's a chick. I don't know. Just disgusting. Anyway, moving on. We're going to go into one of the worst, if not worst, dungeon in the entire game, the Idar Flam, which is much like the freaking Namaton Monastery or the, the float from Shadow Hearts 1. God, I hated that area, but I knew my way around it because I had played it, you know, so many times. This one, not so much. Well, if you really just want to blow through this one, just go straight. But if you want to get all the items in the game, then, well, in this place, you can only come here once, by the way. If you want to get everything, you just follow what I'm doing. What? Storybooks. Definitely has some super evil something about it. Yeah, we're going to crush it. We're going to blow it up. Blow it to smithereens. Teach him a lesson. Alright, so you come here and there's some steam in the way. And it doesn't do anything. Haha, <laughs> I tricked you. Basically, you're just going to keep going straight for a little bit. And there's tons of little paths that you can take. Some leave the dead ends, some don't. And I'm going to avoid the dead ends. Because there's nothing there. Not even treasure chests. Yeah, what is this? Something's coming out. What? Ew, is it about to spit spider eggs at me or something? These things are called Gigafilarias. Uh, fantastic. They're pretty easy to kill. Um, where's the one that hits me? That, that's the one I want. There we go. Ah, oh, fudge. I forgot she's got the slow ring. Speaking of slow ring... Well, no, that's just speed down. That was my fault. What? That didn't kill it? Damn. Okay, you little bastards. Bright crime on somebody. Someone. Man, really? Now I can only hit one? Damn it. Ruins my whole setup. Tough little bastards. For some worms. What? Just killed your pedo. What a bunch of bastards! I'm shocked and I'm in shock and awe here because I can't believe they just like two turns and red freaking Geppetto's dead. I mean, they are hitting pretty freaking hard. 61 damage. Ow! Stop it! Would you guys stop it? Damn, now I gotta revive the people here. The enemies are like kicking my ass here for some reason. What is going on? Uh, let's revive Geppetto. Damn it! <laughs> Geppetto, please, for the love of God, beat this dude. Okay, let's just not talk about the marionette thing he's got on. Let's just try passion out and see how it. Let's see what it is. What, what does passion do exactly? What the hell? If by passion you mean giant pumpkin, then okay, I will accept that. What in the hell? Let's see, I'm gonna transform because I won't be able to kill him in one turn. This is ridiculous that little worms are kicking my ass. I will not stand by and get kicked in the face by stupid worms. Absolutely no. I still couldn't kill him. No, don't. 
so angry right now. Because these stupid worms are killing me. What the hell? Why are worms kicking my ass? It's like worms 3D all over again. I don't care about your speed increase. I'm gonna go down. I almost messed up again. Even with like my armor upgrades and everything, these things are hitting so freaking hard. What the hell? I guess they're like little mini bosses or something? I don't know. It's freaking annoying. And you're gonna have to fight a bunch of those, by the way. It's Yeah, there's a ton of those. Ugh. Jeez, please. Well, good thing I stocked up on some healing items before I left there. Moving on. So here you can go either left or right. I'm gonna go to the left. Because there's a treasure chest. Yep, I stopped right in front of the chest. We get a mana root. Alright, not bad. And there are random encounters in here, too. It's not just, you know, running stupid worms. Whoa, that was creepy. What the hell? It's like aliens all over again. Oh, man, we got another one of those. I'll be right back. Okay, so that team is not working out. I am switching to Geppetto, or I'm switching out Geppetto to my Team B, or... Uh, you know what? Freaking screw Geppetto in general. I'm not using him right now. Because he's just getting his ass... They keep killing him. I don't understand... Why they just keep beating the crap out of Geppetto, but they just do not like Geppetto, and it is ridiculous, and I'm getting sick of it. So I'm switching them out for, um, <clears throat> they're beating up on Blanca and Geppetto. Like, there's only two people they're beating up on. What the hell? So I'm switching to Yohim here, Yohim, whatever you want to say. Oh, you know what? I forgot to put the pedometer back. Everybody needs to take off these stupid freaking, um, we don't need them. Shoot. Hey, let's do that. Trophy money up. All right. I forgot we had Leonardo's barrel on everybody, so it's like... Kind of gimped? Sort of not really. That's good enough. Let's move on. So coming up here, we have a path we can go to the right or to the left. We'll go straight. So what I want to do is go to the right first. I believe this is the right... That's weird. Huh. My map is kind of wonky right now. Down this way. That's the way I want to go. My map is kind of inaccurate, but whatever. We got another door here. And beyond this door is... No Wait, where am I? What the hell? My map is worthless. Oh, we got some new enemies here, anyways. <sighs> well, besides these stupid worms, we got some other ones. Well, these aren't as strong, obviously, because I just crushed them in one freaking turn. What is this guy called? He is a echidna. Knuckles the echidna? No, not really, but it's an echidna. Oh, fudge! Well, at least I can kill him with Yogi. Hey, kitty, what's up? I oh, know. Jam it! Well, at least he died. Straight boot to the face killed him. This is like an alien wolf. Its name is Hey. Where am I on my map? I don't understand how I got lost. The map says take a right right after that barrier and it didn't freaking work. It took me around some weird way. I'm confused. Wait, no, here, this is where I wanted to go. Okay, so my map's a little inaccurate, but whatever. <laughs> Should be a chest right here. Here we go. That's what I want. Let me get a Jupiter fan, which I already freaking bought. Damn it, hold on, my kitten's attacking me. She's trying try to bite my, my uh, freaking headset, and she's scratching me at the same time. 
All right. Anyways, moving on. We want to keep going this way because there's a another treasure chest over on this side. On that whole left side, if you were to keep going north on the left side, there are no more treasure chests except for an, uh, a dead end, which I'll get to in a minute. Oh, we got another enemy called Zamuza. Know, all kinds of new enemies. I'm gonna go for Haiti here. Of course, that didn't kill him, because he's a bastard. Oh, can I hit two? I can't hit two. Sweet. Didn't do nearly as much as that guy. He must be like a... Oh, he's not dark element. He's a wind elemental? No, he's light elemental. That is definitely a light elemental attack. Oh, I, should, I forgot to use the panoramic lens. I actually think I have to equip that. I don't think it's like an ability. I believe it's an accessory only she can use, which allows me to take photos of everybody in the battle, so I don't have to individually take shots at things. Thorn, you bastard. The enemies in here hit pretty freaking hard. Oh, at least Geppetto leveled up. He needed to level up. He was kind of behind. Now I'm getting my ass beat again. Let's see, who has Art Cure on? Who has it? You do. Let me check that. I'm pretty sure it's an accessory she has to... Yeah, panoramic lens. And it boosts her your stats all around, so that's pretty nice. Alright, like I said, I'm not going to be able to get through this all in one run, like one video. It's just too freaking long. I'm going to have to stop... I think at the the boss room because there's a lot of roaming around here. Well, that's only if you want to get all the treasure chests, which I do. Me want treasure. God damn it. Okay, so I'm back from kicking their asses and I switched my team to Team C, which was, um, okay, uh, yeah, there's a path down here, which is Lucia. And uh, Anastasia, Yohim, and Yuri. Yuri's always going to be in my party because he's just, he's Yuri. I need to level up the main character. I need to. He has to be in every battle because I don't want to grind later to be able to beat one of the more important bosses. Which is a pain in the ass to beat. Straight up. Um, uh, yeah, but there is a boss that I, I believe you gotta solo it with Yuri, and it's good to keep him in your party at all times just so you can build up enough experience without having to grind later on to be able to beat said boss. Okay, so there should be an item over here somewhere. Or it could be. No, no, here, it's over here. I just gotta find another one of these stupid egg things. Ugh, be right back. There's the chest right there. Okay, so the enemies just target whoever's the weakest in your party at the moment. It's just like, they automatically will go for whoever's got the lowest amount of HP and just stick on them. And the, what makes it worse is those guys keep freaking using Gale over and over again. So they just have this constant speed bonus, which really is freaking annoying. Um, also, I want to mention that the make sure that you take a snapshot of the wolf enemy or those little Zomzura guys or whatever because they'll or maybe it's not the Zomzuras but it's those wolf looking dudes because they will give you um, a skill uh, called 100 press or heavy press or something like that for Anastasia okay so uh, yeah just make sure that you take take that photo because it is very important because I don't, I don't know if you can get it again later I, I don't know if that enemy shows up again or what have you but like I said, I, I can't express enough. Make sure you get that photo. Just in case. He, if another enemy may have it later on. I don't know, but um, that is important. Now, here, you can either go... To, you want to either go both ways. You want to go left and to the right. But uh, I'm going to go to the right first. Because this way has three treasure chests. There's the way to the left has only two. And those will be the final two chests that we can possibly get in this area. Man, there's so many fights. That's the problem with this place. Is it's, there's so many damn fights just trying to get to these treasure chests. There's no, like, super repels or anything like in Pokemon. <laughs> That'd be too convenient, I suppose. So what you want to do here is you want to go down. 
Because there's two, or there's like a dead end that has three treasure chests. Alright, we're back. Decided to run from that fight because they weren't in the right formation I wanted that would allow me to kill them really quickly, aka lined up right next to each other so I could blow them up with one spell. <laughs> Here we are, three treasure chests, all for the pickings. We get a soul benediction, and we get a cosmic bracelet, and finally a strike expand, which I will be using shortly. Alright, now I want to go all the way back to the... I want to go all the way west. As far west as I possibly can. Alright, another fight down. Well, good thing about this is it's really good experience from all the enemies I ran away. You know, it's, it's making up for all the experience that I didn't get because I was running away from all those enemies in the last dungeon. There was just too many. I didn't want to deal with it. <laughs> Oh, but we had this is the 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 final as I mentioned this is the final dungeon. Well, no, there is one other minor dungeon of the disc, but this is the fi final major dungeon of this disc. Uh, after we beat this, before I go to the final dungeon, I'm going to be doing a video just of some side quests, finishing up Europe, um, much like in Shadow Hearts One. It's kind of a point of no return. I, th I think you can come back to some of these areas. I don't remember it. It's been a long time since I've played, so I can't remember if we can come back to Europe later or what have you. But it's just it's just like freaking Shadow Hearts 1 where it was like you went to China and then you have to do all your side quests and then the game's like, oh, you go to this different part and then you can't come back here. Yeah, I'm running away because they're not spread. They're not in the right order I want them to be in. They're not all crammed together. I'm not fighting. I'm just gonna run because it's just quicker that way, and I can get through this crappy freaking maze area. Good thing is I don't have to fight any more of those egg creatures, the really powerful ones, anyways. The way I'm going now is a pretty good way to go. We're gonna avoid the last egg sack thing. Just to think. Weird. Why did I come to the dead? Did I miss a turn? Hmm. No, oh no, I didn't. I just need to go down. That's right. I go down and to the left. switch to this team real quick because I want to keep Yohim in bat form for this upcoming bat, f <laughs> bat boss. boss fight <laughs> dyslexia kicking in there damn there's so many fights What? I thought I didn't have to fight it anymore. My map lied. There is another one of these. Ah, oh, fudge. I'll be right back. Did I mention how much I hate this area? Because they just keep killing Geppetto. Like, I can't do anything to keep him alive. He just gets murdered, like, every freaking turn. I put him on defend, they still murder him. Because there's so many of them, and they just all gang up on him. Even blocking, they're like, 26, 26, 26. He doesn't have that much HP. He has 200 HP. And then they keep putting speed on themselves, so they do. They just go like a million times, just beating on Geppetto all day. What's this game's deal with beating up old men? See, my map said there wasn't one of those things over there, so I'm kind of confused. And we get a silver bracelets, and the final treasure chest in this area is a Thera root. All right, now from here, you just want to get in the battle. Or you could just run away like I'm doing because I don't want to fight any more of these guys. I just want to get out of here. Damn long corridor dungeon. Ugh, this is the worst dungeon in the entire game. 
I don't know, that other one with the color puzzle was pretty bad. This one doesn't have any puzzles, it's just a freaking long, narrow corridor after corridor after corridor after corridor and hallway after... It feels like I'm playing Final Fantasy XIII, but I like that game. <laughs> Damn it! Just keep on heading up. All right, now I just want to go north. This is the final part, I swear. I, there shouldn't be any more. If my map is correct, which it was wrong in the past, there should be no more of those freaking <clears throat> insect things along this path. And this is the long path. Really freaking long path. As you can see, I'm just, like I said, I'm just, I'm just running. I, I have no no interest in any of this experience. I've gotten plenty from this area. I'm at the level I want to be, which is 26, or 25 really is what I'd like to be around this area. Usually when I play, I'll be like 28 or something, because I, I fight everything when I'm not recording. Here it is. All right, we're at the final area, and I can finally end this episode. Um, so the f next episode, we're gonna... What the hell? The Gay Brothers are here? Are you really... Ex <laughs> like, really, are you surprised at all? You know, they're, they're gonna be here. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna end the episode here, guys. Uh, next time we're gonna fight Rasputin, kick his ass one last time, and uh, end this disc. So, this is Zangfei500, and hope you guys have a good one. Take care.